Hey, man, put respect on my son's name. I've been saying it for over a year now, but Shar Jackson fought back. Pop Smoke wasn't no little sucker like that, bro. Beyond his years, just turned 20 years old, but got the soul of a 40-year-old grown man. He was on his P's and Q's, and I can, I can tell he felt the energy in the house with the female, and you can say with Mike D and all of them too, and, and people in the, the room. The man fought back, and he wasn't going down with it. We, we've been selling this for y'all for the longest, but I got happy now that I'm seeing that they finally showing you on the reports and everything else. It was a struggle. It wasn't nothing easy like that. Cause to see niggas is capping, all these youngsters in the videos, they try and make it look like it was an easy move. And I, bro, first of all, it was a back door of a back door of a back door. Meaning that it was a lot of fuckery going on that we still ain't even solved yet. But put respect on Pop Smoke name. Everybody that is trying to make this man look like even in vain he went out like a coward or something like that. It was several bloggers making it look like that too. And that was my only gripe with these clout chasers. If you're going to clout chase, don't disparage his legacy. Don't disparage his character, who he was. He definitely fought back. I remember when PNB Rock said, and I don't know how true this was. That's why I've never made a whole video. I just always brought it up from time to time. PNB Rock said to the people he was close with, and I'm going to say allegedly too, so if it's true, Pop Smoke don't get in trouble because these dirty people will charge you and indict you even if you dead. It's just factual. They did it already. But they said Pop Smoke also buzzed back. I've been hearing this a whole lot. A lot of people is going to say, oh, it ain't true, it ain't true. But the only idiots who said it, I'm not going to say idiot. Let me be cool. The only people who always say it ain't true is people who are like me and you and all who's just from far away from the story who are just hearing he say, she say. So I understand if you say you're going to fall back till you get more concrete evidence. But to just say it's not true because it's a feeling you feel, come on, man, get the hell out of here, bro. Is it far-fetched a man like Bashar Jackson, a.k.a. Pop? smoke he wouldn't bust back he wouldn't fight back getting a real entanglement i'm talking about the real type of entanglement and i even said that to his brother like there's no way i see a man like him his demeanor you can feel his energy his presence there ain't no way this man ain't even fight back and you it makes you question the fact that he's the only one who got hit He's the only one who fought back. Yeah, you don't hear nothing about nobody else doing nothing else. In fact, Mike D, you were clean, bro. You didn't even have your man's blood on you, bro. I find that questionable. You didn't even have your man's blood on you, bro. Like, come on, bro. That's my guy. This is the my, my niggas I've been through war with. Family, friend, all that. We damn near brothers in real life. I'm going to be holding you like, man, fight, fight something, bro. Instead, you LL Cool J with the operators. Nah, I don't want to talk to you. Nigga, quit worrying about being arrested or something or being indicted right now. Fight for your man's life right now. Fight the way he fought for his life. Fight for his life the same way. And you did it. Failure, bro. Failure. So people can say what they want, bro. It's too many questionable things in there. And I've already touched up on that. I'm just more... I'm more alleviated and happy, relieved, bro, that, that finally you giving him the recognition he deserved as a warrior, bro. You probably like, why am I even talking about that part? Why are you trying to make him look cool? Bro, it ain't got nothing to do with that, bro. Give a man a warrior's death, bro, because I don't believe he's resting in peace. He died in a foul way. I do feel like it's a setup a thousand million percent. So I'm not one of these people to, I'll say rest in peace, but I always make sure to tell y'all I don't believe he's resting in peace. I don't believe no man and woman that dies that way, they resting in peace. I don't believe it. I believe it's up to us, the ones who rock with the movement or even his loved ones or his homies or the woos. I'm going to keep saying that, the woos, the woos, the woos. I'm not saying that disrespectful. If I had a group in a movement and I died in this demeanor, wouldn't y'all say, the same thing mine's supposed to ride for me ain't that this whole hip-hop thing of ours ain't that's what all of y'all preach ain't that's what y'all making fun of other hip-hop artists about this being loyal to each other riding for each other so it don't it don't fit the description no more do it man i gotta salute my man bashar jackson man your warrior spirit i knew it from day one i remember i remember the first time i was like that was him in the video i remember seeing the video of him getting slapped with the hat when he was just a youngin and i didn't know it was him the whole time but i remember seeing that video on world star all of y'all remember seeing that video 
And then they fast forward and he gets his lick back. The coming of life, the circle of life, the 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 the, the blossoming of a flower. You get to see the levels of it. And this is his level of showing you I'm a man now. And the transition was a smooth one. So to see this man losing his life in an epic proportional way like that, bro, and not see nobody else getting touched. Nobody else getting hurt. Then why are we listening to this garbage for? Because it's garbage music. If you, I'm not saying you got to live it, but damn, I'm not even saying you got to drill. But what about fighting back for your mans and them? I don't want to hear nothing else, bro. It's not being disrespectful. It's being very honest, and I'm not afraid to say it. A lot of you guys are just monkey see, monkey do followers. You're going to copy the wave. I'm not afraid. I always was that kid in class when it was like walking line. And I said, there's nothing wrong in making kids conform into that, but to inst institutionalize them into a robot, now we have a problem. Now, you can teach them to follow directions, but I always was that kid, like, I'll follow you in line, but if I'm thirsty for water and I ask you for the water and you don't let me get it, I'm not going to sit there and starve. I'm going to go get the water. And that's why I was that kid over there. Like, I'm going to think outside the box. They gave us a box of crayon and they told us, trace inside the lines. I was that kid, like, no, I think the picture should go this way and I trace outside the lines. Then I get older and all the wise people and all these intelligent people in life are always telling me you were that kid who was going to be intellects because to, to color inside the line is to conform yourself. And I'm not conforming myself. So public opinion don't mean nothing like that. But Shar Jackson to me was a hero because I feel like the way he fought back, it probably saved the lives of the cowards inside that house. I'm going to say it again. The way he fought back. He probably saved the lives of the cowards and the people who set him up inside that house. Because this thing can't be looked at no other way than a man taking self pre self -preve uh, self pre Damn, man, I can't even pronounce it today. I'm, I'm on fire with my rap. But self-preservation, he's taking it to the, the highest mountain of what it means, bro. He fought back. Make sure y'all talk about that when you say all this extra and you trying to clout chase. Make sure you talk about the warrior that Bashar Jackson was. That's all I'm saying, man. Talk about the warrior aspect of it. Don't make it about your clicks and views, my nigga. Make sure you, you see the warrior that this young brother was. I hope this video damn sure is embedded in y'all head. Pop Smoke fought back. Whether you think he shot back or not, but case in point is the whole thing we trying to make you know is... My nigga fought back. My son wasn't going for it. Salute to Bashar Jackson. Anybody out there miss represent, representing this man's name? I think I'm going to have to stop sitting on the bench, bro. I was I was off the bench for a minute, but I've been on it too long. I'm about to get off that bench and call out names as needed to like it should be in a YouTube public domain that's following the guidelines. Yeah, I know how to strategically do this now because I, I sat back. And I watched my beautiful viral videos that Yah and Smoke Gang did that made more grips of things and seen with the all seen eye of what's really going on and transpiring in his case. We called out a lot of names who was not afraid to put our, or maybe even harm being done to us. And we did that. And I feel like time is to get off the, out that bench again. A lot of people is really with the clouts. And when I say the clout, you messing up progress with what we seen to find answers in his death. Because at the end of the day, the answers is a beautiful thing versus what these other people are doing. Factual. Look, I'm your God bless one, man. Love your family. Love your kids. And stay blessed.